What's cracking, everybody? Welcome to another break night. Now, before we begin, if you are watching from YouTube, please do us a big favor and hit that thumbs up for us. Also, please vote in the poll at the top of the video to rate this break. And, of course, comment down below. Let us know what you thought the hit of the break was. Now, let's get to it. Let's crack that wax. What's cracking, everybody? Happy June 8th, 2019. Welcome to Crack and Wax. I am your break host and resident wax cracker. My name is Christopher, and tonight we're doing a bunch of 2019 tops finest, maybe a little bit more. Well, definitely a little bit more because we also have a free box break. We are running our May free box break as well now before we get into all that um yes we do have just a couple of spots left in one of our tops finest box breaks that is uh, the box break number three if you go to crackamax.com slash shop you look for the tops finest break that is still available it should be number three uh we have two spots left and if it fills tonight it breaks tonight also, we could end up breaking our final available box of 2019 Definitive Collection. As you see there, we have seven spots left there as well. Just go to crackandwax.com slash shop. Let's check out the chat room and see who's all with us today. Deezy and Kanto in the room at the same time, at the same place. I don't believe what I'm seeing here. It can't possibly be. How are you doing, Kanto? How are you doing, Deezy? Debbie? Dame Debbie? I, we were talking offline a little bit ago. Uh, good to see you here. We'll probably have a few people trickling in and out, as always. Uh, hopefully, we'll have a few more hopping in, because it is the free box break day. I do want to talk about something else, though, before we get into our free box break. We'll uh, take down the chat room for just a moment. We got our first, uh, our very first card donation for our upcoming Allen & Ginter charity event. Uh, this is coming from Sean R. So for those who are unfamiliar with our Allen & Ginter charity event, every year we run a big charity event surrounding Allen & Ginter. And the reason for that is Ginter was one of our first real big charity case breaks and now of course you know this year every break we do is for charity but this year Ginter will be just as big as ever if not bigger than ever we do have quite a few sponsors on board this year which is awesome and we always ask our fellow wax crackers and collectors alike to make some prize donations so what happens is, is I round up all these sponsor prizes and all these donations from fellow collectors and wax crackers and we toss them all into one big prize and one person will win that entire collection of prizes as the what we call charity prize pack it's basically a thank you for helping us raise so much money for big brothers big sisters what we end up doing each year and what we will be doing this year as well is if you make a $5 donation, we'll give you a, a, a thank you. And that thank you is basically uh, a chance at winning all these prizes as one big prize pack. So for every $5 you decide to donate, and don't do it just yet. We have we don't have that set up yet, but uh, you will, you'll, you'd have a chance uh, to walk away with uh, who knows what. But uh, it, it, it definitely will be this stuff which we just got today. And I'm just gonna show them all off. Now this is just one person's donation and this could be by itself enough. So we've got a graded 9.5 Chase D. Young, 9.5 Yadier Alvarez. Let me get that on screen a little bit better. Autographed Mason Denneberg, autographed Khalil Lee, 
Obviously, those are redemptions. Marwin Gonzalez, 71 and 94. Tops Archives. Got a clearly authentic Miguel Gomez. And that's uh, numbered 48 of 50. We've got an authenticated Billy Williams autograph on an original 1976 Tops. We've got a BCCG Star Quest Upper Deck First Edition. David Ortiz, Mint, 9.5, Jarrell Cotton. We have a cut auto of Carl Erskine, Leaf History of Baseball. We've got a Shohei Otani insert from Diamond Kings, a Tony Singrani rookie auto. This is a Jeff Bagwell bat and auto, 21 of 49. Cole Wynn, Otto, Ryan Sandberg, Dual Bat Relic. We've got a definitive collection, Buster Posey Authenticated Relic with Pinstripe. Allen and Ginter, Theo Epstein, Mini Auto. John Lamb, Dual Relic Auto with Patch, 17 and 49. And then the big one, of course, is the Warren Spawn Cut Auto. All of that was donated by Sean R., and all of that will be going into the charity prize pack, which one person could win later this year during our Allen and Ginter charity event. Um, just as a thank you from us for donating at least five bucks. So it looks like Canto says he bought a spot. So let's let's just double check to make sure that Canto indeed bought that Nat spot. I'm going to bring up the chat room so people don't see that I'm lying here. Uh... Looks like I've got an order. And it looks like. Yep. So Canto's got the Nats. So we have one spot left in that final, finest break. At least the final one that is posted, anyway. I'm going to quickly fix that. And I could always. I've got, I'll, I'll have a, a leftover box. I can always put that up as well. So, so let's see. Nats, Canto. So let's talk about the free box break for May. For those of you who are new to Crack and Wax, what we do is each month we give out some free box break entry tickets for any hit list spots. So if you purchased any spots in May of this year and any of those spots went hit list, you probably would have received what looked like a drink ticket. Basically, it would look like one of these guys. You would also have received in the month of May uh, one of those tickets or at least the numbers if you showed uh, showed off on Twitter your hashtag Crack and Wax Mail Day. That's just our thank you for uh, letting everyone see uh, what you hit from us. What's up, Justin? And then what we do is we collect all those tickets in that month, and then the following month, we run a free box break. The boxes that we purchase, um, we, we, we throw $25 about per break that we do in a month, so the more breaks we do in a month, the better the box uh, could be. So, I mean... We've had some monster boxes, and but we've had some teeny tiny boxes that also produce some pretty good results. I try to make sure that the boxes that I select will produce, you know, some interesting things. I don't think we've uh, had, you know, some real crap boxes. But uh, last month, May, we didn't do a ton of breaks. Uh, so we don't have a ton of tickets. And we didn't spend a ton of money. But with that said, however... I did make sure that we are going to get some good stuff, hopefully, uh, out of our free box break. So, if you're joining any breaks in the month of June, so any of these finest breaks, or uh, Definitive Collection, or Luminance Football, so on and so forth, any hit list spots, we'll get those tickets, and then in July, we'll do the free box break for this month. But right now, at this very moment, we are going to be uh, concerning ourselves with May, and just with every single box brick that we do i'm going to be selecting six tickets i'll be calling out the numbers and if you want to tell the chat room 
If your number was selected, please feel free. You don't have to if you don't want to. If you want to stay anonymous, that's completely up to you. I know who belongs to each and every one of these tickets, so there's no worry about whether or not you're going to get your spot. Tonight, I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm going to be personally assigning pulled cards to the tickets. So I'm not going to be announcing random divisions. It's not going to be hit draft or anything like that. I'm going to look to see whose tickets these are without telling the room, and I'm going to be randomly assigning uh, card well, let's see, let's see, on cards. So the first ticket I've pulled is 831265. If you are the owner of ticket number 831265, you have a free box break spot tonight. And now I'm gonna take a look and see who that was, and that way I'll have I'll have an idea of what card or cards I might want to give to that spot. I've never done that before, but that is actually part of our free box break, uh, break rules, is that the break host gets to personally assign the cards. I've never done that before, so I'm going to try that tonight. And there's a good reason for it. Scott, what's going on, sir? Good to see you. All right, if you have ticket number 831279, you will be in the May free box break, and I will assign you, personally assign you pulled card or cards. Debbie, how do you know you're in? I, I thought you dropped everything on the... <laughs> you were able to recover the, the, the tickets. That's good. <laughs> All right, we're going to be pulling four more tickets. Some of these tickets, as I mentioned, were from hit list spots. Other tickets might be from Crack and Wax Mail Days. 831077. I forgot to look at the back of this other one. Okay. 831077. If that's your number, you are in. And I can tell you that the previous number, I haven't seen that person in the chat room. And I haven't seen this person in the chat room either, but I have a pretty good idea of what these three folks might want. Let's do three more. And I believe there's one spot left in finest and nine spots left in definitive. So if either one of those fill tonight, they will break tonight. Eight three one two zero two five. Eight three one two zero two five. If that's your number, you've got a spot, and I will personally assign a card or cards to you, depending on what we pull. Two more. Like I said, there's a good reason I'm doing that because of what I purchased for the free box break. Eight three one two zero eight two gets a spot. 8312082. And this person is in the chat room. I won't say who, but that person is definitely in the chat room. Final ticket. And I'm going to be making absolutely sure everybody gets something. 8312098. We'll be getting a spot. 8312090. All right. That was just me looking at the back just to make sure I could read my own handwriting, and I think I got it. Okay, so the box for May is actually three boxes. I had such a good time with this product and it's such an affordable product with hits in it. <laughs> um, in fact, we are able to pull six hits. I decided let's do it. Let's, let's do three boxes of Onyx Vintage. There should be two hits per box. So there's gonna be four cards per box, two on-card autos per box. Um, of course, one of them could be a redemption for a graded star rookie. We did pull uh, one of those once. And uh, hold on one second. I think we've got an order for Finest. And if that's the case, then I have to pause and shut that down just so we don't have an over order. Just double checking here. 
And it looks like we are sold out. Looks like John E. purchased the Angels. All right, so we are full on that last finest. So I'm gonna just pause for a quick second. So please bear with me while I shut that down. I actually contacted WooCommerce and asked about being able to automatically shut breaks down after a certain amount of teams are purchased. And they 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 so they, they told me they have no idea how to how to make that happen. So um Hopefully that's that's something they can address in the future, so I don't have to you know pause during the middle of a break to just to shut a breakdown. It's easier to do you know full PYTs or if there's like you know random teams or something like that, then then the break will shut itself off. That I don't have to worry about. But it's these fancy triple team hybrid ba uh, breaks that I love to put up here that uh, I have to pause for. But uh, as I'm doing that, let's talk a little bit further about the On uh, Onyx Vintage. So we broke that a little while ago, not too long ago, and it was such a fun product. I, I love the fact that, yeah, Onyx isn't one of the big, you know, companies. It's not Tops, It's not Panini. Although, in being like Panini, they, of course, aren't able to use, uh, they don't have an MLB license, uh, thanks to Tops, But they do have uh, an MILB, or not MILB, uh, um, and MLBPA license, Major League Baseball Players Association license. So they are able to use player names and player likenesses and things like that. So we could end up with uh, some good uh, good autographs out of this product. A lot of them are going to be hot rookie and prospect autos. So like Eloy Jimenez we could find in this. I believe, uh, I believe Acuna might be in here if I'm not mistaken. Now, the drawback to this product is there are only 22 total cards. 22 total cards on the checklist. Which is why it's good that we're only doing three boxes. All right. So I think we're all caught up. I think that break is shut down. So let's get to it. Here's our free box break for those who went hitless in May and those who showed off their hashtag crack and wax mail day in May. And like I said, I will be personally assigning cards. That means I won't necessarily be telling everyone who's getting what as we're pulling them. But I can tell you we've got a redemption. And uh, we're not going to play Guess the Redemption because this is a free, hit, uh, free box break. But we do have an Eric Pardino... And, well, there's an autograph. There's a Gerald Perdomo D-backs auto behind Noel de Marte. And behind the Geraldo Perdomo is a Paul Molitor rookie. So 1978 Topps PSA graded Paul Molitor rookie. That is very nice. So we got two hits, one of them being a PSA graded Paul Molitor rookie. That is cool. All right, no redemption in this pack. And we start with Pedro Castellanos, Boston. There's Geraldo Perdomo's base. Otto is Joe Adele for the Angels. And Tampa Bay, Brent Honeywell. I'm very happy to see that we're not seeing the same cards from the last break. I was really hoping that uh, we get a little bit of a mixture here. All right, final box. For the May free box break. Debbie, I figured you'd like that.
Eric Pardino. So we've already pulled that card. O'Neill Cruz. What's up, Tim? Joel Booker. White Sox Auto. Ooh, nice. And Alex Kirilov, Red. Twins Auto. And the Reds are limited to 25 copies. That green Honeywell is limited to 50. Now, it says numbered two. They aren't actually numbered. There's nothing numbered about any of these cards. But just know that this Kirilov, there are only 25 total red ink Kirilov autos in this set. So that was our May free box break. I will be personally assigning these cards to the six free box break spot owners. And up next, we will be doing our 2019 Tops Finest Half Case. Pick one, get one. Put these out to the side. All right, gonna take down the chat room. And I'm going to fix my bar up here, just so everyone knows that that break is full. But do be aware, our definitive collection and luminance breaks still have plenty of spots. If either one of those fills tonight, we will break them tonight. Now how we're going to handle picking out boxes, what I've done, you can kind of see as I'm dragging them in, I've, uh, numbered each box one two three four five six seven eight so one two three four five six seven and eight and i'm just simply going to be rolling two die two dice gosh i always screw that up rolling two dice and whatever number we hit that's the box we're going to use so we need four total boxes So obviously I don't have a box nine, so gotta roll again. And that's a nine again. All right, there we go. So we've got box number seven will be used for the pogo break. That is a seven. We'll set that right there. That is a four. Box number four. That's a 10. And that is a seven. We've already pulled that one. And three. No, you can't. And that's why I'm eliminating one right now. And a six. There we go. So these are the four boxes that we're going to be using for our half case pogo. And we're going to do a a little bit of a quick education on Finest for those of you who aren't uh, all that familiar with Finest, but I'd be awfully surprised if you weren't. Details here. So you're gonna have in each box, too many boxes, six packs per mini box with uh, five chrome cards per pack. Each mini box is going to have a hard signed autograph. Your refractors will include a base 
typical, you know, regular rainbow shiny refractor. And then the colors include purple, blue, green, gold, orange, red, and super refractor. Uh, we also have an extended base set. And if we go over to our set checklist, that will be cards number 101 through 125. The refractor parallels are only gold, red, and super refractor for those 25 particular cards. We also have Mystery Redemptions. A and B are not in this. Finest Mystery Redemptions 1, 2, and 3 are part of the set. Those redemptions have not yet been announced. We have no idea who they're going to be, although some people probably could guess. We do have quite a few different inserts. And of course, Finest is known for being very gaudy. Kind of a an ugly looking set, but kind of in a fun, cool way. I've always liked Finest. In fact, Finest was uh, one of the first boxes I purchased for myself. Yeah, Kanto says Finest is better than Chrome. It can be. Uh, it just really depends on the, on the, the set for that year, so... I'm all right, so let's get into this. Let's crack that wax. Get the three boxes over that we're using. Let's start with box number three. The uh, the recipe, as it were, for finest hasn't really changed all that much over the years. Although when I first purchased my first box, I think it was like an 08. That was back when they were still doing the uh, letter patch autos. The manufactured letter uh, patches and, and then the, the player or the rookie or the prospect would sign the manufactured letter patch and the first box I ever bought for myself in each mini box was the same damn pl uh, player's letter patch and I was so bummed and it was some brewer scrub who never made it to the majors I'd never heard I can't remember the name um, but at least one of them was a refractor parallel and the other one was the base but the <laughs> I kind of hated, I kind of hated Finest at that point. Just because of that. But I got over it. I started buying it again the next year. And things went uphill from there. No, we don't know the random teams yet. We haven't gotten that far yet. All right. Chris M is here. What's up, dude? All right, so randomizing the teams for our Pogo. Make sure I got my correct screen on here. Now, since we used one dice last, let me take out these two and we'll just use one dice this time here. We're rolling our once. And this is how many times we're gonna randomize our teams. We got a six. We're randomizing everything six times. Screen view on. Boom. All right, these are the unpicked teams, A's through Twins. Always breaks my heart when the Twins aren't picked. One, two, three, four, five, and there is six. And we'll drop that into our team assignment right there. Here are our wax crackers. We will do the exact same thing. One, two, three, four, five, and six. We will drop that right over here. All right, team assignments for our Pogo is as follows. Richie S, that's BRSBB cards. You've got the Red Sox and Rangers. Canto with the Nats and Twins. Dame Debbie with the Phils. White Sox, Mariners, and Dodgers. Dan B with the Yanks and Rays. Fieldy, that's uh, Reed. You've got the Angels and Tigers. ENT with the Astros. Brewers, Pirates, and Giants. Jason S with the Indians and D-backs. John E with the Mets and Marlins. John W with the Cubs and Reds. Justin M. With the Padres and Rockies, Matt Glav Smoltz, that's Chris M. You've got the Braves and Orioles. PR Nuts, that's Scott. You've got the Cardinals and Royals. And Tony M, you've got the Blue Jays and A's. All right, we are going to put up the chat room. We are going to put up the clock. And it is now 5.31 our time. We will give you until 5.33 our time to make any trades that you might want to make. And go! 
I don't know why you think that I would know by now that it's one die, two dice. I just can't get that through my head. I don't know why. It's just weird. Now, Community Gum, how did I forget that you're filmbrats.com? I, I knew that and for some reason forgot that. Folks, filmbrats.com is Community Gum. A great blog, a great trading card blog that... How long have you been... How long have you been Community Gum? I feel like you were around when I started Crack and Wax when we were only a blog back 10, 11 years ago. All right, we are running out of time here. Doesn't sound like anyone's gonna wanna make any trades. It kinda sounds like people are kinda happy with the randomization. You know, I tried the many usernames thing and then that just got too much to handle. <laughs> Nearly 10 years. It took, uh, okay. So it was kind of around the same time. All right. All right, it is 5.33 our time. Doesn't look like we're making any trades. We will pull the clock down, pull up the screen view, and I will make our fancy old team board, and we will crack that wax. There it is. That's the teams for the Pogo. Everything looks right to me, I think. Making sure I didn't make any mistakes. Yep, everything looks good to me. All right, let's do this. Pulling down the team board, pulling down the chat room. Give us a little breathing space. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let's see, Debbie Royals for Mariners? Sure, okay, let me fix that real quick, but we are not doing any trades after this. Royals and Mariners. All right, so Dame Debbie is getting the Royals and Scott P is getting the Mariners. All right, remaking the team board. All right, how's that look? All right, I think we got it. All right, teams down, chat down. Let's crack that wax. And our first finest card of the year, appropriate, Byron Buxton. This is a twins household here. Very happy to pull. I think Canto got the twins, right? Yep, Canto, you got my you got my Buxton. Aaron Judge. This is what the backs look like. Oh, we've got an autograph already. And our autograph is Mets Jeff McNeil rookie auto. This is a green parallel. Seven of ninety nine. Mets are going to John E. John E, I believe, is a crack and wax rookie. Getting that rookie mojo. Congrats, John. 
right out of the gate. Ramirez, refractor of Justin Smoke, Vlad Guerrero. There is a little bit of a dent there. If you can see that there, who has the Blue Jays? Tony M. So many apologies there. That came out of the pack with a little dent. Chris Bryant, Mitch Haniger. Looks like there was another new order. I'm going to have to check and see what that was. Hopefully, we don't have a conflict. Grinky, smoke, blue chip insert of Blake Snell. There's the back of the blue chips. Josh Bell, Sally Perez. Okay, so that's uh, another definitive collection order. So we've got six spots left in definitive collection. So if you want to add that tonight, we'll break that tonight if it fills. Six spots left in definitive collection. Carlos Correa, Albert Pujols, prized performer, Didi Gregorius. There's the back of the prized performers. See what I mean by how, just how gaudy Finest looks, but I love it. Yeah, Mitch Haniger with the ruptured testicle. I, You know what? You laugh about it, and I laugh about it, but man, doesn't that just make you wince? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Chris Shaw, Carlos Correa, refractor. First, uh, finest first, Kyle Tucker, rookie. Here's the back of that. Paul DeYoung. Dan's Bay. Justice Sheffield, former Yankee, Jacob DeGrom, Blue Chips, Ronald Acuna, Jose Altuve, Kristen Stewart, who went yard on the Twins today. My Twins, who are supposed to be really good, have been not doing as well against their own division all of a sudden. I don't know what's up with that. Reese Hoskins, Blake Snell, and Ryan O'Hearn. Well, there we go. Royals got traded away. We've got a refractor rookie auto of Ryan O'Hearn. Could have gone to Scott, but instead it's going to Dame Debbie. Nice trade, nice trade. And then Michael Kopech, Walker Bueller. I feel like every time there's a trade, or every time there is a denied trade, we pull a hit for that team. Pujols, Refractor, Aaron Judge, Blue, 62 of 150. And Jose Barrios. Fernando Tatis. Trey Mancini. Blue chips of Justin Meadows. Or Justin. Austin Meadows. <laughs> Trevor Story and Will Myers. For some reason, I was thinking Justin Morneau when that came out of my mouth, and I just confused the two names. Justin Meadows was just born tonight in Crack and Wax Manor. Matt Chapman. Prize performers, Sally Perez. Juan Soto. Corey Kluber. Ryan Eads pitching for the Twins right now. Congrats to Ryan Eads. It's kind of sucks that he has to enter a game losing 5-2, but there you go. Uh, Mike Trout, Colby Allard, refractor of Chris Shaw, rookie refractor. Billy Hamilton and Glaber Torres. Oops. Uh, there we go. Nope, that's not it. There we go. Made a trade last night, and the guy who traded with me hit a one one Isn't that... Doesn't I just figure? Doesn't I just figure? Good lord. 
uh, Kyle Wright, Noah Syndergaard, Blue Chips, Ahmed Rosario, Jake Bowers, and Ryan Barucki. That does it for the first box. Scott, are you in our luminance break? I don't have my team board up. If not, you should hop in. We got uh, 23 teams left right now. Maybe you can get that, get that one of one back. Yeah, man, you should hop in just to see if I can pronounce Sonny Michelle correctly. No, Sony Michelle. <laughs> see, I did it wrong. Uh, Kyle Tucker, Anthony Rizzo, and Fran Mel Reyes. Rookie autograph for the Padres. Padres, going to Justin M. Justin, I think I saw you in the chat room. If you're still there, congratulations. Picking up that Fran Mil Reyes rookie refractor auto. Francisco Lindor, Cody Bellinger. Tucker again. Of course, that one is the refractor. Acuna, DJ Stewart. There you go, Justin. Gregory Polanco, Charlie Blackman, Blue Chip, Gary Sanchez, Mookie Betts, Corbin Burns. What was the one of one, Scott? There's another Buxton. Aaron Judge. Price performers, Mike Trout. Marcus Stroman, Chris Bryant. Ramirez, that Grinky, refractor of Anthony Rizzo, Mitch Haniger, Josh Bell. Justin Smoke, Carlos Correa, blue chips of Alex Bregman, Josh Hader Green, two of 99, Sally Perez. So just from what you've seen so far, how are you feeling about 2019 Topps Finest? I think it's nice to have a Chrome product that's not the flagship design. I think it's nice to have something with its own dedicated design in the Chrome. That and Bowman, I should say as well, which is uh, Bowman's best, you know, Topps Finest, Bowman's best. That's what they do. And if I, got, I, I got to put these packs in the bottom here because we've got a Michael Kopech. Finest first, blue, rookie auto, 95 of 150. White Sox going to Dame Debbie, getting her second hit, and this is a good one. This is a damn good one. Congrats, Deb. Danny Jansen, Luis Urias. Traded away the 49ers for the Bills. Jerry Rice. Oh, ouch. Ouch, ouch, ouch. Rowdy Telez. Cedric Mullins. Refractor DJ Stewart. Chance Adams. Ramon Toriano. Yeah, I think from 
here on out, I'm going to have to put that top pack at the bottom. <laughs> Just so we have something to look forward to. Unless there's a super fractor in here, which I know I haven't said it yet tonight, but uh, can you believe in 10 years we haven't pulled a super fractor? Scott Kingery, Josh Hader, David Peralta. Which is even stranger now because uh, when we first started doing this, we did like, I don't know, a few boxes here and there. And then we started doing like one case every other month, not really breaking anything else. Prized performers, Clayton Kershaw, Glaber Taurus, purple, 247 to 250. But for those of you who have been hanging around with Crack and Wax for a while, you've noticed that uh, we've been ramping things up. We, we've gotten to the point now where we've got so many breaks loaded up that we can, this is the second week in a row now that we've been filling breaks live on air, which is what normal breakers do so now now we're starting to feel like a, a normal breaking operation around here willens ostadio rookie refractor poor guy got sent down uh today he'll be back though that's la tortuga finest first michael kopeck this is the unsigned base version to go with that autograph aaron noah joey Votto. not a bad pack well not a bad box for deb Davis, Ostadio again, Jesus Aguilar, Blue Chips, Miguel Cabrera, and Miguel Andujar. That's the second box. Collect the Mariano Rivera Finest Careers 10 card set. Now, I wonder if and when we're going to come across that. Uh, across that. I'm going to guess that in a full case, we should be able to pull at least one of them. Of course, they are honoring him for being the first unanimous selection to the Hall of Fame. I don't know why they chose Finest for that, but there you go. So six spots left in Definitive Collection. 23 teams left in Luminance. If either of those fill tonight, we will break them tonight. Crackamax.com slash shop as always. Okay, what? Pull my soda auto before my pizza gets here so I don't throw pizza all over my computer. Oh, come on now. I think you should just do that anyway. For good luck, you know, for luck. Just throw pizza at your computer and 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 because you did that, then I will pull a soda auto. And it'll be the refractor auto but only because you threw pizza at your computer. Well, I pulled that Soto Auto out of Bowman's Best last year with those two Otani Autos. That was the craziest freaking case I've ever seen. And, that, and of course, that would be the, the free case break that we did last year. And uh, before we go any further here, I do want to thank Blowout Cards for the discount, as always, on our cases, keeping our spot prices nice and low so that we can afford to do these all as charity breaks, so it's very, very helpful. For those of you who are watching us from Twitch or Breakers TV or Periscope, uh, hello, folks. How are you doing? As I say every week, unfortunately, uh, we're not able to attra uh, attract, attach the chat streams from Breakers here. And I'm not sure if the Periscope chat is working all that well. And I haven't seen anyone from Twitch in a while. But if you're there, how's it going? So we got a rookie card of Pete Alonso, Justice Sheffield rookie, Michael Franco. Let's see if any of those were the extended. Okay, but Justice Sheffield was a refractor. Bregman, Ozzy Albies blue chips, gold refractor of Ben Intendi, 18 of 50. Scooter Jeanette. And I believe... No, we don't. Okay, I thought it was a... thought it was a redemption. I was about to play our game, but that is not a redemption. Uh, finest prize per, uh, performers, Jose Altuve. Steven Duggar. Purple, 180... I'm sorry, 169 of 250. Getting closer there. 
Max Kepler, Brian Anderson. Duggar's base card. Tuki Toussaint, rookie. Jacob deGrom, refractor. Finest first, Jake Bowers for the Rays. Buster Posey. Blue chips of Francisco Lindor, Kershaw, Yelich. Probably have our autograph in there. I'm going to keep that. Don't you just love the suspense? Rowdy Telez, rookie. Refractor of Reese Hoskins. Tendi, Darius, Chance Adams. Mullins, Trey Turner, blue chips of Miles Nicholas, Ramon Laureano, and Josh Hader. Willie Adenis. Nolan Arenado, Justin Smoke, prize performers, David Peralta, Starlin Castro. Well, it's nice to see Cruz finally hit a home run. J.D. Martinez, Brandon Crawford, Blake Snell, Refractor, Aaron Nola, Joey Votto. Blue Chips, Trey Mancini. Anthony Rizzo, Gold, 22 of 50. Miguel Cabrera, Miguel Andujar. All right, so these two packs more than likely have an autograph in them. Joey Gallo. I'm going to guess. Oh, it's a redemption. Hey, well, you know what that means. You know what that means. It's time to call your shot. All right, folks, listen up. First person to correctly guess the redemption wins a random prize. And you must have an account at crackandwax.com in order to win a prize. Now, don't do it just yet. Don't do it just yet. Let me put up the chat room. Remember, the first person... And we will let this run until 5.56 our time. And go! Ichiro Auto. Vlad Jr., Matt Chapman. Frank Thomas, Chris Bryant, we'll let this go for about another minute, Kikuchi Chris Torres, hello, John W says Molina, Scott says Vlad Sr. Well, you've already made a guess, Mr. Scott, so that one won't, won't count. Chris, I didn't. Th I don't think I saw you. Uh, you you walk into the chat room. Sorry if I if I didn't see you before, Chris. How you doing, sir? Nice to have you in here. All right, any last guesses? Time is almost up. All right, time is up. <clears throat> All right, we're going to move on and see who the redemption is. And it's upside down, right? So I gotta turn that over when we get to it. Javi Baez, Joey Gallo, Xander Bogarts. All right. Congratulations. 
you are due to receive A. I'm surprised no one said one, two, or three. Finest autograph, gold refractor. Ooh. Hey, we are playing Call Your Shot right now. We are just about to reveal the redemption. LQ's here with her with her beer and what else I you got have? You a beer and a piece of fudge for when you take over. Oh nice. Oh you're already having I am already beer. having a beer. Oh CRT, what's up, CRT? Alright, here we go. Of Vlad Jr. Ooh. Chris M. Chris M, you guessed correctly. Now, first of all, Vlad Jr. is a Blue Jay. And the Blue Jays going to Tony M. Tony M, you've got the finest auto gold refractor parallel of Vlad Jr. Ever. And Chris M, you're getting a prize. Now, let's let's find out what you're getting for, uh, for a prize here, Chris M. All right, you are you ready, LQ? Yeah. Do I get to spin it? Well, I gotta I gotta load up my app here first so it can spin. Fudge. All right. Now I'm gonna turn on the thing here. All right. All right. Which do I hit? All you have to do is hit that button. I wish I had to pull something. Nope. Right there. Here we go. It's All right. Spinning. 50 wax bucks. Congratulations, Chris M. You just won 50 wax bucks. Congratulations. And Tony M. gets a Vlad Jr. Gold Refractor Auto. Ah. Nice. All right, Thank let's... You, Scott. We'll see you next time. Have a good night, Scott. go on to our next pack Ooh. the yellow one is a bigger number I can't remember what it is but <laughs> it's a bigger number well you know where they are <laughs> Ronald Guzman Whit Merrifield and Tyler O'Neill refractor auto for the Cardinals Cardinals are going to say it. you're gonna say it oh, yeah. we'll have to find the button first That's my thing. Cardinals are going to PR nuts. Scott, who just left. Oh, leaving the chat room mojo. That's, that's right. Hashtag leaving the chat Everybody room mojo. Get out. Get it's out. It, get your I don't want it to be a thing. <laughs> Congrats, Scott. Then we got Shohei Otani and Danny Jansen. No. You don't put beverages on any trading cards you ever. I. I stopped doing that. Why? Because no one was watching those. Oh, but you would? Let's see. Leave the chat room open. You've got it. Oh, yeah. So, LQ, I'm very proud of her. She has accomplished something pretty big, and uh, as I'm opening these two boxes, do you want to you want to mention your accomplishment? Um, I started running again. Running. And running, and I have been on been doing keto diet. I don't know if you guys know that is um, for the last month. Fourteen pounds in a Woo! month. And my big thing is getting my muscle percentage up, so that's all fat, and then I gain back muscle. I'm very happy. So you've lost fourteen so, pounds. If anybody wants some tips but, about butter and eggs and whatnot, I'll, I've got tips. Well, you won't oh gosh. I've but, got tips. Always. You are a chef, though, too, so but, you would you would have had those tips regardless. That's true. But what was your motivation, besides from looking sexy for your? Well, I always <laughs> look sexy for mm -hmm, my mm -hmm. um, I don't remember. Diet bet. Oh, yeah. Money. <laughs> Money's my motivation. So she got hooked up on on, on diet bet, <laughs> and she easily won that bet. And you've got, what, another week to go? Or... Yes, I've overshot it already by 1.2 pounds. 
already. So are you going to stop or are you just going to keep going? I'm going to keep going because you can still win um, bonuses for placing above and beyond. So. Nice. Charlie Blue Blackman. Charlie Blackman Blue, 11, or I'm sorry, 112 of 150. Okay, what is smart ass Okay. And by that, I mean Andrew. Or Deezy. Or Deezy. He says, lost 20 pounds since winter just by leaving the house. Oh, you know what? Hey, activity. That getting out there. That's activity, you know. I thought you were going to say you lost 20 pounds in, in like muscle atrophy from your leg breaking. That, that'll do it. Yeah, yeah. Blue chip of Shohei Otani. Nice. Yes. But it, honestly, my favorite thing in the world is being a I, I think it, it might be up there with you should, on, you should run, you should run and read at the same time. Well, that's my audio That's not reading. Jacob DeGrom, oh, Price Performer. So reading, don't even. You have to have like a book up in front of your face while you're running. Okay, so if ch- somebody's turning reading, the pages. Oh I'd be impressed by that skill. I'm really interested in that. You have an opinion on that. On reading? A, yeah. a refractor, Ronald Acuna Jr. This is our final box of the half case pogo, by the way. And then we will do our first of three solo boxes. We do also have six spots left in our definitive collection triple team as well. Who just hit a home run? Ah, oh, Tigers hit another home run. They are, yeah, twins are not doing well. Brandon Nimo, Nemo, Nimo. <laughs> Speaking of Tigers, Nick Castellanos, Giolito, Miguel Andujar, Refractor, Jose Barrios, Trevor Story. So, of course, if you want to hop into Definitive Collection or Luminance, that's cracklemax.com slash shop, as you see on the screen there. It's actually six left now, not seven left. I have not updated that just yet. Blue chips of Mitch Hanniger. Now, Mitch Hanniger, you probably, I don't know if you've heard about this, but he is the player that has the ruptured testicle. Ouch. Didn't he shoot a foul ball off of his crotch or something like that? Ouch. So, Canto, I, have, I believe it or not, I have a story about a ruptured testicle. Canto is really, really hoping that we pull. He, he got the Nats in this, and there are okay. hardly any Nats, and he really wants me to pull a uh, Juan Soto auto, or else he's going to throw pizza at his computer. Oh. I told him he should just throw pizza at the computer, and that will give him the, you know, the, the pizza mojo. Mm-hmm. And then we will oh. pull the auto because of that. Oh. George Springer, finest prize performers. Oh. Anyways, okay, so rupture test. Um, so we had a drummer in our jazz band in high school. He was and it wasn't bad. me. It was not you. Nope. Um, this guy was absolutely amazing. But he ended up like basically doing the drum solo of his life. Um, practicing for a thing at solo ensemble, and he ended up rupturing his testicle. Ouch! Doing that, and he said it was it was. Just, was it worth it? Uh, I I think he just mentioned it was the worst pain he's ever experienced in his life. Ouch! 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 So All anyways, right. That's my story. So we've got two packs left. Both of them will have an autograph. At least they're supposed to. Behind Xander Bogarts, our autograph out of the first pack is a refractor of Kristen Stewart for the Tigers. Tigers going to Fieldy. Reed, you got yourself a Tigers auto. Congrats, buddy. LQ writing notes over here. Are they love letters? Are they hate letters? Final pack of the Pogo half case. Behind Blake Snell, we have something wavy. And it's a Royals. Brad Keller. Orange wave, four of 25. Now, I seem to remember the Royals being traded away from Scott to Dame Debbie. Oh, boy. 
That trade worked out quite well for Debbie. Congratulations, Dame Deb. Nice. Kanto wants someone to laugh at his joke. I didn't see his joke. Oh, let's let's put up the chat room. Hold on. Oh, I love Turn Twilight, Kristen Stewart. Ah! That's the second time he's made that joke, actually. Okay. So. Did you drop this one? Oh. Oh, I, we accidentally dropped this card. Oh. It's uh, the Juan Soto um, paper it's a mini. fractor mini. Can you see the shape? Yeah, it's a mini. That's a mini. Yeah. So it's pretty much hit of the night. Yeah. I'm. That that signature doesn't look suspicious at all. Not at all. Oh wait, no, 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 no. The back is just not done. This would pass through PWCC, yeah, wouldn't look it? At that. Yeah. I mean, look at that. I think so. It even looks a little bit trimmed. It, it you know. It's a little trimmed. I, yes. Well, it's a mini tissue mini cricket. Yep. Mm -hmm. yep. Whatever. Okay, so that's. Well, here's the uh, wow. hip re hit recap. Wow, I mean, I've, I've never seen anything like I'm that. I'm surprised before. it doesn't say two of one on there. Oh, well, no, we don't do those things. Oh, maybe, you know what it is? That is a two of one. No, no. It's a, it's a very, um, a very popular uh, unknown ranking. It's a, it is a, a five of. It's a, a via Roman, Roman numeral. Roman numeral. It's, <laughs> it's a via V Juan Soto Auto. Uh, Brad Keller, <laughs> Orange Wave, four of twenty-five somewhere. for the Royals. It doesn't exist. Kristen Stewart, rookie refractor auto. Tyler O'Neill, uh, refractor auto. Of course, we've got the gold refractor parallel. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Yeah. The blue for Debbie of Michael Kopak, ninety-five of one fifty. Friend Reyes, refractor for the Padres. Wow. Ryan O'Hearn for the Royals and Jeff McNeil, 7 of 99 green for the Mets. That Very does nice. it. Yeah, beautiful centering. That, was really, really that nice. does it for the half case pogo. <laughs> we are going to take a moment to get things reset and then we will be back for the first of three solo finest triple team boxes. Uh, hang out for just a couple of minutes. If you want to head on over to crackamax.com slash shop and pick up a spot or two in our definitive box break. That is our final box of Definitive. If that fills tonight, it breaks tonight. Uh, I want to see, what is the inscription that Debbie's talking about? Heck, of, heck, heck of an inscription. Heck of an inscription. Two. Oh, the XOXO. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oops, yeah, that was an accident. Yeah. But, you know, mm -hmm. Juan, Juan loves what he loves. Yeah, he does. All right, we will be back in just a moment, folks. I thought there was an inscription on the, or something. No, it was your inscription. Oh, yeah. Okay, now we'll be back in just a moment. Okay, one cue. Okay, we are back, and it is time for the first of three boxes. So let's decide which one of these we're going to be breaking. Five.
And it is five. Box number five. Your Magic the Gathering. And of course, this being a triple team hybrid, you get to pick one team, then we'll give you two additional random teams. So let's figure out what our random teams are going to be. Firstly, I'm going to select these teams. And because we rolled a five, we're just gonna randomize everything five times. Those are the 20 unpicked teams. Yeah. Then we take our 10 wax crackers. Do that five times. And this takes care of the team assignments for teams 11 through 20. Take the back third of the teams, do it all over again. Wish I had a script that could just do this one, <laughs> you know? And take our 10 wax crackers once again. Okay, team assignments are as follows. Let's see my chat room here so I can show everybody. All right, so Kanto, you've got the Nats, Rockies, and Padres. Chris C with the Angels, Tigers, and Royals. Dame Debbie with the Phillies, White Sox, Twins, Mets, Reds, and A's. Dan B with the Yankees, Giants, and Cubs. Grizz, you've got the Astros, Braves, Dodgers, Brewers, Marlins, Rays, Cardinals, D-backs, and Red Sox. Jason S. with the Indians, Pirates, and Mariners. Tony M. with the Blue Jays, Orioles, and Rangers. Hey, Chris. Thanks for being here. See you, Chris. Thanks for coming in. All right. So it is 6.14 p.m. our time. We will give you until 6.16 our time to make any trades that you may want to make. And go. Padres up for trade, says Kanto. Really? What? Whoa. Kanto. Interesting. Curious trading for what? You know, I can rock all Which list would that be? Mm-hmm. I think Debbie would approve. What? Mariners or A's, maybe. So, uh, Debbie... I don't know. You really want to trade with Debbie? I mean, usually, as we saw in the last break, <laughs> you trade to her, she ends up with the hits that you could have had. I don't know, man. <laughs> Do it, Debbie. Let's see what happens. Jason has the Mariners. I don't think I saw Jason in the chat room. And unless Debbie went to get a beverage again, she probably didn't see that trade. <sighs> Or Mets. Let's see who has the Mets. Oh yeah, Debbie's has, has the Mets. Who smelled it? All right, it is six sixteen. Our time trade window is now closed. Yeah. But it has to do with what it looks oh. like on the stream because there's a delay. So if it shows. Debbie, she's going to do it for the 
Debbie it. again. So this is the second time now after the trade window is closed. Debbie's she's stealing it. She's stealing all right, the trade. all right, hold on. Now, right. now for the second time in a row now, just because, right. just because I like my wax crackers and we're friends yes. around here, yes. I, I'll allow the trade this time. <laughs> but just remember, Kanto, we're gonna end up pulling, you know, a Tatis autograph out of this. Because you don't understand the Dan Debbie luck. Mm -hmm. if you're willing to trade with Dan Debbie. But we're doing it. A's and Padres are gonna be are gonna be changed around. Yeah, I so I feel like you traded a curse, man. So Kanto gets the A's. Because Debbie's magic. Dame Debbie. All right, there we go. Okay. It it is done. <laughs> it is done. Trades. Whoa, so mortgage free. Trades are definitely <laughs> definitely closed. Uh, All right, I'm gonna wow. make I'm gonna make the team board and we will get on with it. Good feeling about this, Kato. Boy. All he really cares about is I've this. I've really never been wrong in my life before, so we'll see how this goes. <laughs> All he really cares about, though, is the Soto auto, I think. Really? Well, yeah. he, you know, he can probably rest easy, though, but he has that 555. The V of V? The, the V of V and Nomen numerals. Right. Yes. Oh, good. Bases are loaded. Don't worry about it. What happened to my team, man? Gotta get ready for the next, uh, next break here. <laughs> All right, team board is made. Let's make sure everything looks good there. Canto has the A's. Dame Debbie has the Padres. Oh, yeah, I looked it up. Padres have more autos, but I get the A's so much. And random, I might as well just make sure one of my team's... <laughs> and I really have no stake in the A's, so if you want them, they're yours. All right, there we go. Take down the chat room and let's crack that wax. So box number five, if you remember, is the box that we are doing. This is a single box, triple team hybrid. And of course, oh, oh she's changed the, the score on, the, on my screen. That is cute or something. You should have drawn something else then. Whoa, jeez, I just knocked into my camera. Oh yeah, the, no, what you wouldn't have done was had the cards on screen, excuse me. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> As true, I don't listen to anybody. <laughs> I did make a decision about my running shoes. Oh yeah, what decision is that? I'm going to donate the ones you wore today. Oh why? Never, those are, I have too many miles on those suckers. My left foot, I'm done for a couple of days. It holds. So now we have to remember, we have to give Chris M his 50 wax bucks for winning the Call Your Shot, Gregory Polanco uh, Refractor, Colby Allard, 43 of 150, Blue Refractor. So the people call their, not call their shot, um, list what they're looking for? Not yet, tonight? not yet. I haven't asked, so. That's usually your stick one. Well, quiet. yeah, well, I already know what uh, Kanto wants, so. I know if I ask him, that's that's what, what we're going to hear. Because Kanto is an active chatter, and we appreciate you. Yes, yes. Well, some people just listen to the break from their, their John Deere, so. That's true. Uh, prize performers, Justin Upton. Drinking their crappy pitch black soda. <laughs> Uh-oh, pizza's here. You, Now's your chance. Get that pizza, throw it at the computer, and after you do that, I'm very sure we're going to pull that, that Soto Auto for you. Charlie Blackman, Refractor. I can break some. Scott, yeah, you missed a little fun. <laughs> as soon as you left, you got a hit. I can't remember what it was, but you got something. Yes, so did Canto, my friend. Glaber Taurus, Blue Chips. Black and green olive. Ooh, you're the nemesis of Chris. Eating an olive would make Die. I would eat a Hawaiian pizza before I eat that. But, fun fact, I did grind up a bunch of sun-dried tomato green olives and put them in meatballs one time. And I ate it? You loved it. I hate you. D. Gordon oh, Refractor. It was instead of adding salt and then instead of adding 
vegetables. It just kind of... She does that kind of crap all the time. She hides stuff and doesn't tell me. God, I hate that. And I'm a good cook, so you don't know. <laughs> it was back in Brooklyn. <sighs> I told you right after you ate it. Matt Chapman, blue chips. But I also, fair enough, I said there's something in here that I'm going to... That is not normally an ingredient. Listen, listen. What? You and I are in a fight right now. No, we're not. <laughs> yes, we are. There is one time... <laughs> <laughs> Do y'all remember Alestro? Alestro. Hold on, we got we got some <laughs> finest uh, prize performers: Edwin Diaz, Purple Refractor, Dansby Swanson, one thirty-six to two fifty. So Chris said that like there was no way that he could deal with that, and I wanted to try it. And we were in a test market where Ovi was in Pringles or something like that. So I may have switched out. Uh, Pringles, regular for Pringles, but the fat free ones. And he ate them and he had absolutely no reaction to it. <laughs> but I was in a food science course that was talking about the fact that a lot of people actually don't have a reaction, that it's just, you know, whatever. I hate you and it was so fun. Much. But yeah. Blue Chips Allure's Gorilla Jr. Why did you break Pringles? There, Juan Soto. There you go. Did I break? Uh, da -da -da. This is so Sunglasses. Sunglasses. Yeah. That would be cool. I didn't say that. that would be I didn't cool. say that at all. Are you sure? Well, I'm positive. I didn't say that at all. All right, we've got an autograph coming out of these next two packs, so let's pull up the team board. I gotta say, though, I am curious as to why the hat. I go through because, sunglasses? Because you're actually pretty careful with your stuff. I didn't even do anything that time. I literally just put them on my face and snap. Were they cheap? They were like 20 bucks. That's not super cheap. I fixed that last one, though. Thank God. I know. All right, behind Matt Chapman, our first of two autographs. We've got Fernando Tatis with the Padres. Oh, oh, what, oh. Happened, what, with what happened with that? Padres. Padres. Hmm. Dame Debbie. Now, if I remember correctly, that was the team that got traded for the Indians. I feel like hmm. Now let's check the chat room and see the reaction from the peanut gallery oh, here. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. 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 Can't believe it. <laughs> ha, ha, through tears. <laughs> wow, that is unreal. See, Debbie, are you in the room? Trade away mojo. Oh, that's Dame the Debbie is the beneficiary right. of two trades I now. I am picturing the most evil laugh in the world coming out of Dame Debbie right now, like a moi. Ha, 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 ha. I just, is it happening? Debbie? And is this Please not the me. autograph that I called would happen? <laughs> yes, you did. Yes, you did. Well, Crack and Wax was actually famous for foreshadowing. I mean, I'm serious. I did. I called the five. I mean, right. Let's, let's talk about it. Scott. Okay, so Scott traded away a, a team in a Luminance football break. And the team he traded away, they ended up pulling a Jerry Rice one of one. Oh, God. Can Look you, at how he, he types that in the It sounds so solemn. All right, so to make up for it, uh, to make up for it. Congratulations, Debbie. <laughs> wow. That is hilarious. This is sad <laughs> and hilarious. And sad. Oh, okay. okay. Well, we've got, uh, well, I know what team it is. I think it's Dame Debbie Mojo. It's not trade away Mojo. Well, here's an Eloy rookie card also going to Dame Debbie. And Jose Abreu also going to Dame Debbie. Oh, and Albert Pujols. No. Chris, you got that one. Oh, I thought she had Dame Debbie. I don't know. Chris oh. Shaw. Behind that, um, 141 and 150 blue. Paul DeYoung, Cardinals. Going to Grizz. First time we've called Grizz tonight. Is that in the house tonight? Grizz is not in the house. Absentee Mojo. All right, well, Scott, thanks for joining us. Uh, have a good night. Glad you were here to watch uh, watch that. Uh, thanks, Scott. Watch hilarity ensue. It's good having you. All right, so that was box number one. All right, if you could put that to the right of the four stacks. Thank you, LQ. <laughs> because then I won't remember which deck is in there. I have 
to decide the next box. Oh, okay. I'm going to call it eight. Wait, you can't roll it. I can if I had two dice. No. Oh, you have two No. What? So the next box is. The next box is. Need to roll a one or a two. Is a one. Okay. Bart, wait. Bart, wait. So we're doing box one as the next box. So there was never a chance for eight. There will be a chance the next time around. No, I just meant right now. No. And you kind of complained about having two dice in there anyway. See, it's got. I hate it when you roll a 12. That's just so loud. Right. Well, there would be less chance of rolling a 1 or a 2 with, with that. No. Why are we still talking? Because you asked and I'm no, answering. No, just, just do your thing. Just do it. Can I do my thing? No. Just do it. Are you sure? Just do it. Okay. Just Thank you for letting me run my business. Thank you very much. I appreciate oh, it. Oh! Can somebody murder Womp Womp uh -huh. for me, please? Okay. So this is triple team hybrid number 2. Yes. There's there's a chance it could. There, yeah, you're asking a lot of questions. Uh, there's a chance we could do it next. I just flipped him in the head if you couldn't hear that. Just let me know if it's a good one. Okay, we are set to go. Since we rolled a one, we're going to be randomizing everything once. So this should be a little faster. <laughs> Those are the 20 unpicked teams for box number two. Everybody in the same break? Nope. Okay. So, Cantle, you have a chance to make another disastrous trade. There, take the back third. And our ten wax crackers. Team assignments for box number two is as follows. Canto with the Nats, Cardinals, Rangers, Angel. I'm sorry, just those three. Nats, Cardinals, and Rangers. Chris C. with the Angels, Padres, and Mariners. Dame Debbie with the Phillies, White Sox, Giants, Rays, Marlins, and Brewers. Dan B. with the Yankees, A's, and Rockies. Grizz with the Dodgers, Red Sox, Pirates, Cubs, Astros, and D-backs. Jason S. with the Indians, Mets, and Reds. Mad Glav Smoltz, that's Chris M with the Braves, Tigers, and Orioles. And Tony M with the Blue Jays, Twins, and Royals. It is the triple team hybrid. All right, it is now 629 our time. We will give you, I'm sorry, 630 our time. We will give you until 632 p.m. our time to make any trades that you might want to make. And go. Kanto is done trading. You know, I bet he ends up with a Tatis, a Tatis autograph. Does he? Yeah, I bet he ends up with a Tatis autograph by the end of the night. I don't know. Somehow, some way. You know, I, I don't know if uh, that's ever going to happen. Because it's very rare. Very rare to get both a Soto and a Tatis autograph yeah. in the same night. Yeah. I think it could happen. <laughs> As you see on the screen, we are also doing Series 2 next week. We've got six teams left. 23 teams left in Luminance. We'll probably end up doing that next week. Doesn't look like that's going to fill tonight. But uh, six spots left in our definitive collection. Triple Team Hybrid.
says seven left on the screen, but it's really six. Crackamax.com uh, crack slash shop is where you need to go if you want to pick up some spots, get this filled out. The uh, WNBA Pogo is at the end of the month. Well, Canto says he's going for that Nolan Ryan auto for his Rangers spot. No, that's not going to happen. <laughs> Doesn't look like any trades are going to be happening. It is 6.32 uh, our time. Trade window is now closed. Okay, here is the team board. No trades were made. Looks good to me. All right, let's crack box number one in box break number two. I know that's kind of confusing, but... So aside from Soto and aside from Vlad Jr. and aside from Tatis, since we we already pulled Tatis and Vlad Jr. and we already know that we're trying to pull Soto, who else are we looking for? We also got Kopak, so we're not looking for him anymore. I'm out of, out of space over there, unfortunately. Who else are we looking for tonight? Refractor. Yep. Uh, blue chips, Luke Voigt. Performers, Yadi Molina. Hey, we got a die cut finally. Mariano Rivera, finest career die cut. Not numbered. Still. A cool insert to find for the Yankees. Acuna. Now that's an autograph I would love to pull. Is uh, Mo Rivera. That'd be, that'd be fun. Nope, just the one. Blue chips, Jose Martinez. And then we've got a purple of Corey Kluber, 64 of 250. Byron Buxton, Refractor. Yeah. 
Blue Chips, Miguel Andujar. And uh, Yusei Kikuchi, I believe that's one of the extended base set. Yeah, 101. So we do have at least one of the extended base set. Those Mariners. Mariners going to Chris C. No, no one said that they are not loving it. It's no, just. No, but I mean, like in your eyes, then what makes it? Oh, it's just you know, kind of like that. It's very you know '90s gaudy, and that's the point. Is because that's when I believe that's when the set was first designed was in the '90s. So it's kind of a callback. It reminds me of a poster. Miguel Cabrera Green, 63 of 99. Danny Jensen rookie. Probably Bowman. One that you did a redesign of. Just kind of background. Not a redesign, but you put a brighter red around the super basic. I don't know. Is it on the video that we did? Oh, I bet, yeah. You, so you liked that one, but yet. No, I didn't. So well, you didn't. Did. Well, then it wouldn't have ended up on the list. Because that was voted as one of the five worst. No, but it's still one of the five worst. But there's some people who are super, super loyalist to oh. it. I have no idea then. Aaron Judge Refractor. Find his first UC. Uh, Yusei Kikuchi. Rookie and Chance Adams. Blue Chips. Rysel Iglesias. Ramon Mariano. All right, let's get to our autos. Behind J.D. Martinez, we have a refractor auto of Ryan Barucki for the Blue Jays. All right, and the Blue Jays are going to Tony M. SP card fan Tony M. Congratulations with the Ryan Barucki rookie refractor autograph. You dropped something. Oh, I'll show it after I'm done with this pack. But you dropped it earlier. Yeah. Oh. So the auto's in here? Yep. And okay. Steven Duggar, behind Steven right, Duggar. What did Debbie get? Yeah. <laughs> I think we're going this way. Yep. Ooh, it's low numbered. Oh, it's two of oh, five. Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Minnesota Twins, Eddie Rosario. Oh, my favorite. Two of five. Oh. Twins going to Tony M. There you go, buddy. Getting the clean sweep of the box. Oh, Rosie's the best. Yay. Well, not not entirely a clean sweep because I did drop an autograph on accident. I keep dropping these autographs. I'm such a bad breaker. We accidentally dropped this uh, Fernando Tatis um, uh, Bowman Square. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that looks uh, totally like his autograph. It's going to be really tough to get that. I mean, that's a lot of dink. And the Padre is going to Chris C. So congratulations, right. Chris C. Look at that. I mean, that's well worth the price of the I think we should right just here. give this to Kanto. I mean, probably. Yeah. I don't know. We might need permission. Sorry, though. Chris C. We're going to give this to, to Kanto. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, you know, just, you know, baseball rules. Peace out. All right. All right. Man, a lot of five of fives out there. I don't get it. I don't, I don't know. get it. You know, they're really, they're really big um, sellers on uh, Amazon Prime. Uh, five of five is what I'm going to start claiming those. Um, like you've been one of them. Uh huh. Am okay, I got it. 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 Yeah, Amazon, eBay. Yeah, I think. Boy, we got some pretty. Could you actually move that over? Right just here? Mm -hmm, just so I don't. Oh, I don't know. Okay, thank you. Appreciate that. Okay, so the next and final box that we have loaded up, we'll either do two or eight. So I'm going to take down the team board and I'll put up the chat room. Well, let's kind of pull the room here. Folks, would you rather us do box number two or box number eight? I have eight. a feeling LQ wants eight, so we've got to vote for eight. Two or eight. Could I have... Uh... He sir. wants he wants a binary code. Oh no. Hey, 
at Roman numerals and you'll like it. Any votes from the chat room? Two or eight? If we don't get any votes, we'll just go with eight. Okay. LQ says so. Oh, well. Can't tell. Okay, well, does that mean eight and binary? I have no idea. What's he trying to say? Probably does, actually. Does it? Probably. I don't know. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Well, there's only seven. Yeah, I don't know. I, I didn't go to binary school. I'm sorry. <laughs> you went to primary. All right, doesn't look like we're going to get any answers from our wax crackers in the chat room. So let's just go with box number eight, LQ's, LQ's box. Rules. All right. And one final mention of it. We do still have going to have that box so I can show it off. It's eight and binary. Okay. We do have this one last box of definitive collection still sealed up from that uh, case that we did. And I do, I do feel like uh, we do have some good stuff yet to pull out of this. Six spots left to go. I have a really good feeling about that box. I really do. That's what she said. Um, but I do. LQ actually has a good feeling about this box. And I might. No, you, have to, you tell me. And if it fills tonight, LQ breaks it tonight. I break it tonight. LQ guys. will break this tonight. Let me just tell you, I called the night our tree fell on our house, so I do have some. What that has to do with the price of apples in a in, in a, a bushel of milk orange. <laughs> orange balls. Orange I balls. Know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, but anyhow, six spots left. <laughs> Cracklemax.com slash shop. Find the de definitive collection break. Let's do this. We fill it. LQ breaks it. Thank you, LQ. All right. We're doing box number eight. Next, let me find the... Lucky bite of fudge. Oh, okay. Thank you for the fudge. Hey, you sound like Bert Wyleb announcing the game. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right, hey, all right, I hate I hate today's my, game. Uh, pictures are the best. I want to tell you about how I pitched. All right, so since this is box, I mentioned I was a pitcher. All right, box number eight. Now I need to. I actually have to need to finish my my team board here. Actually, <laughs> I would help. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And our tenth. Woo. I think our tenth was was John E. I think. Yeah, it was. John E., who also bought a spot in Definitive, which took us down to six spots left in Definitive. Really? Okay, John E. has the Angels. This will just take me a moment to get this prepped. You want to go to Perkins right now? So is everyone else at Perkins. Screen view. So these are the 10 unpicked teams. And since this is box number eight, we will randomize everything eight times. How fun! That's like your least favorite thing. You have this auditory, you know. Spot owners. Change the cup line. You thought I was going to say one thing. No, no, it's. Not real. That's not a Oh, shoot. I randomized nine times. I got to do it over again. Dang it. I got distracted. <laughs> Crap. Sorry, folks. I got distracted. I was just, just hitting buttons. <laughs> My fault. Although I could have just hit the back button and I think it would have loaded up the other thing. That's alright. Now, it, now it's extra randomized. Oh, 
Ball Bundy. The 10 unassigned teams. Okay, team assignments for break number three are as follows. Richie S., that's BRS, BB Cards. You've got Red Sox, A's, D-backs, Canto, the Nats, Royals, and Rockies. Dame, Debbie with the Phillies, White Sox, Dodgers, Indians, Orioles, Marlins. Yeah, okay. Uh, Dan B. with the Twins, Yankees, Rays, Mariners, Padres, and Braves. John E. with the Angels, Cardinals, and Reds. Mike K. with the Mets, Rangers, and Cubs. SP Card Fan, that's Tony M. Blue Jays, Tigers, and Giants, and Vilma. With the Astros, Brewers, and Pirates. Hey, Vilma, if you're in the room. Hello. Hello. All right, let's pull up the clock. It is 6.48 our time. We'll give you till 6.50 p.m. our time to make any trades that you might want to make. And go. I feel like Canto's way smart. Not I, about trades. Maybe he should trade with but, himself again. Yeah. Maybe yeah. that'll work. Yeah. How's that pizza? get one of your quests. I have to sort. Can you? Can you I are lucky Can I move to be married to. Deb, tell him how lucky he is. <laughs> day and a half. Uh, what? Well, it can't be that good with all the olives on it. <laughs> I think it sounds really good. Actually. You do? Yeah. Um, Canto, what do you, what, what's your job? Like, what do you do in real life? I'm always curious about what people do. He's a bouncer. He's in... He, he's not a bouncer. John thinks I'm in security, which is actually kind of funny. Hey, do what you love, right? Is that your full-time job job or your fun job? All right, it is 6.50 our time. Doesn't look like any trades are going to be made, so... Yes! Hotel front desk. Did that forever. I were not forever. Long time. I want somebody who does that job to write a book because, man, did you know that I got interviewed for one of the people who is my face actually disappeared in the cross? Yeah, you told me that. Thank you asked me a question. You wanted me not to answer truthfully? <laughs> Okay, there is the team board. Gotcha. We are on finest box number three. Could we be doing definitive number three as well? Time will tell. Crackandwax.com slash shop. Grab the six finest, finest, the six final spots and we can make that happen. I think it's a good idea to have one job and a full-time play. Maybe those jobs. There's something about the play. 
Yeah, this, this one is the pay the bills job and my weekday you is wish. my fun job. No, that is not my fun job. There's been so much chaos <laughs> going on at that job. It's just, I'm, I'm glad that Crack and Wax is doing well enough to necessitate going back down a day. So I'm only doing four days a week. Special shout out, by the way, to Stefan and Angela. That's yeah. Junk Wax Twins. And another castle. Another castle. Both in the state. They're not here just to see us. I, I beg to differ. Oh. <laughs> I beg to differ. Canto says, Give you comic books. Nice. Oh, oh, wait a second. So, hey, is that right? Maybe you should uh, link your uh, link your stream in the chat room. I don't think he has mod powers. Do you have mod powers? Do you have a little wrench next? You don't have a wrench next to your name. You need to wrench him. Gosh, should I should I wrench Canto? Let's wrench Canto. Wrench Canto. Uh, I don't know. Hashtag what, wrench Canto. What does the rest of the chat room think? Should we wrench Canto? I think Canto needs to say wrench Canto and then it, you know. Hashtag wrench Canto and we'll make it happen, right? Yeah. Canto, give a link here. <gasps> oh, you're getting magical powers. All right, you've been wrenched. Yes. All right, so Deb was gone for about 10 minutes. Did she miss anything? No, we got in a mini fight, but also, Debbie, I was asking for you to reiterate how lucky Chris is to be married to me. And you didn't and get to you didn't get to make any trades with Kanto. He, he yeah. didn't get to make any irresponsible so, trades tonight. So you're not going to get any hits, sorry. No irresponsible trades by Kanto in this yes. break. Starlin Castro Refractor. Debbie be the best sister wife ever. Have my back. Blue chips, Matt Olson. Also, hi to Andrew if he's there. And give my dad your best. Uh -huh. Prize performer is Bryce Harper in his photoshopped Phillies uniform. Red, Brian, or I'm sorry, Ryan Barucki, five of five. Too bad it's not in the same break as the last one. Uh, very, very hard to pull. Low numbered. Uh, this is going to go to this time around to the SP card fan, Tony M. Wait, maybe Tony M had the Blue Jays in the last one. So maybe this is going to him as well. Hmm. Possibly. I got a That's cool. What's that Because he used to be a Nat and now he's not a Nat. Oh. And Canto Clucks the Nats. That's, that's funny that he traded with a Phillies collector. Wait, wait. The Nats collector traded with the Phillies collector. I feel like that was a and, really not good move. And the Phillies collector benefited from that trade. Wow. Hmm. Just like the Bryce Harper trade. Well, that wasn't a trade. Oh. Whatever. <laughs> Louis Acquisition. Rice. I always bite my nails when I watch this race. What's, well, what's going to happen if you need to suddenly step in? Like, I'm good. I'm not biting you. Know, okay. Keeping it, keeping it cute. Ben and Tendy blue chips. Yeah, see. See, he's yelling at you. It wasn't a trade for Bryce. He was just a sassy boy. That was my Canto voice. Did you hear that? That's one of these kids. <laughs> Joey Votto, <laughs> Refractor. <laughs> He's but just like, a sassy boy. But like sassy with a, boy. But with a wet, like a wizard hat. Wizard hat. Yeah. And like a staff. Not like boys, but like a big old stick. She's not making fun of you. She's making fun no. with you. No. We'll need Demis Blue Chip. Can't take it as a compliment. You've got a wrench. You've been complimented. You've been wrenched. You've been wrenched. Joey Votto, prize performers. Looks like we've got another die cut. Another Mo Rivera die cut. Playing his career. All right, 
wearing a rogue hat with a rogue stick. Er. Rouge. He's not a rouge wizard. He's a rogue way. He's a rogue way. Blue chips. Juan Soto. Ooh, uh, that's, okay. that's not foreshadowing. That's that's it. That's all you get. <laughs> Kyle Tucker, purple, 54 of 250. We are now down to our penultimate pack. Doesn't look like Definitive is going to fill. So this is our penultimate pack. You know what? Our best autos have been coming out of that one. Let's, let's do this one. I don't think so. I think you get to do Definitive Collection if that fills tonight. Not tonight, you didn't. Not tonight, I didn't. Yeah. All right, autograph is Chris Shaw, Giants, rookie auto. Giants, going to SB Card Fan. That's Tony M. Getting another hit tonight. This is a Tony M night. Break something like Limp Biscuit? No thanks. All right, you're going to be de-wrenched if you mention something like that again. That's nonsense. All right, this is Last Chance for Canto. Last Chance for Canto. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Ooh, really? Oh, my God. Really? <laughs> do it! Do it! What is it? Starlin Castro, Aaron Nola, Willie Demis. Okay, I'm freaking the F out right now. I'm yes. Here's why. Because in 10 years, we have never pulled a Super Fractor yes. until tonight. It's happening! We have finally pulled a Super oh Fractor. Oh my god! And it is. There, right. There's a red hat! What? Let's do it! <laughs> oh my god. Canto. What? Look at this. That we've never pulled a super fractor before. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. And there's a red hat, Canto, Canto. Can you see that little bit of red? Is that Nationals red? Is I that don't know. Is that Philly's red? I is don't know. Is it Red's red? Is it Angel's red? What is it? Do it slow. Our first ever super fractor and it's an autograph. Slow. Is. Uh, what is it? Oh, it's not going to be slow. It's going to be like ripping off a band-aid. Here no. we go. Here we go. Okay. First ever super fractor is going to be Steve Carlton for the Cardinals. Wow. Whoa. 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 That's a pretty, pretty card. Wow. Okay. Okay. Cardinals. They are going to John E. That is a Kraken Wax rookie getting our first ever, 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 ever Super Fractor. Ten years. Never pulled one. Thank the Lord. Ooh, whoa! Bucket list. Cross that one off. Oh! Up, Debbie. Did you go into labor? What's going on? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. John E. Welcome to Crack and Wax. Nice job, buddy. That's going to be hit of the year, bud. Ooh, Chris is I mine. don't know. I don't know. This is mine. Deb it's a bucket list. Debbie's Trout Otani dual patch auto, 10 of 10, that she dropped on the uh, 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 pavement today might be the hit of the year. She dropped on the pavement? Not on purpose. What? Oh, you'll have to talk to her about that. Debbie. This is how we ended the break. And here comes card junk. <laughs> this is the last card we pull tonight. What a way to end a break, indeed. That'll do it. Wow. All right, I have to put that down because... Ooh. Ooh. First ever Super Fractor. Holy crap. You f I never thought you'd get one. <laughs> she never... No, I'm sorry. Didn't I... And, and again, with foreshadowing, you weren't even here, but at the top of this break, I had said... You say it every time. Every time, because, you know, if I say it, then it'll finally happen. Then, 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 then I can say that. <laughs> You're such a jerk. But I also called that Tatis I, autograph. I don't care. You're a jerk. <laughs> but I am happy you got a refractor. All right. All right, let's, let's check to see. Did anybody... And, no more spots moved in Definitive or in Luminance, so we will try those two again next week. We do also still have six, uh, six teams uh, left in Series 2, which is also breaking next week, so watch out for that. Uh, and, of course, like I mentioned, we are looking for donations. 
to our Allen & Ginter Charity Prize Pack. This was donated to us today along with a big stack of other awesome cards. This is a Warren Spawn cut auto generously donated to us by Sean R. Thank you so much, Sean. And uh, Yeah, Sean, thank you. We that, will be... When Chris showed me that, that, that is amazing. Thank yeah. you so much. Thank you very much. So yeah, if you do want to donate any prizes uh, to go into the Charity Prize Pack, get in touch with me either via email or uh, DM me on Twitter or find me on Facebook. And Kanto is hitless. No, you're not hitless. You've got some stuff. You saw what you got. You saw what you got. You got five of fives. Yeah. You don't, yeah. You don't be thinking that's nothing. Yeah. All right. So thanks again to Blowout for the discount on that. Um, again, crackamax.com slash shop. Let's fill up Definitive so we can do that next uh, week. Let's fill up Luminance. we got 23 teams left. Six teams left on Series 2. Yeah, LQ will break that when that sells. So those let's are those are three breaks we're aiming to do next Saturday. So let's make that happen. Crackamax.com slash shop. And keep your eye out for more information on the Allen & Ginter Charity event. That is the biggest event that we do every single year. And uh, anything else you want to add, LQ? No, this is great. All right, thanks for joining us tonight. And as always, keep... keep Cracking that wax. Good night. Have a great weekend.